Okay, so the Paladin project has now launched. Um, this is what I am, um, a nonprofit that I volunteer for. And um, the thing I posted today about, so I'm starting to do work for them. And um, the thing I posted today about is um, human trafficking, the signs of human trafficking. And actually it's interesting because I learned today that human trafficking is a term that applies to me and what happened to me. Um, but anyway, appearing, and I thought, oh, this is really interesting. I feel like I fit a lot of these, at least, yeah. Appearing malnourished, <laughs> showing signs of physical injuries and abuse, especially as a kid, this was all true. And I'm like, wow, actually the signs were there. Avoiding eye contact, I did that a lot as a kid. I was really quiet unless I was with other kids. Around adults, I was really quiet. Social interaction and authority figures, I was had an attitude towards authority. Seeming to adhere to a scripted or rehearsed responses, I just, I thought of my dad and all the things he would be like, if the cops come, then you say this. I'm like, Christ, I did all these. Lacking official identification, I had that, except not as a kid, because why would I? Appearing destitute or lacking personal possessions. I'm like, wait. Yeah, my parents kind of just took away what they wanted to when they wanted to. I thought this is really interesting. Working excessively long hours. And I thought of all the jobs I worked and all of it, and I'm like, whoa. Yeah, it's kind of weird. Living at the place of employment. No, but I was like an indentured servant at my mom's house. Checking into motels, hotels. No, although you'd say yes. Poor physical or dental health. Tattoos spreading on the neck or lower back. Untreated STD, small children service, and then this gets kind of into the adult things. But anyway, these are signs um, that you should look for um, that might be about um, human trafficking. So I just wanted to show you some of the things that this just this project just opened up a couple weeks ago, and then this is about a. Although I don't find them personally very helpful, but. Um, so they might help you if you're not me. If you're not me and you don't get a prick on the phone, then they might help you. Um, and then, but I want to show you also some of the other things that they are talking about um, here: internal justice mission, um, and e elimination of violence against women and girls. Um, violence against women. Um, yeah, and, and this is important to know that COVID has affected human trafficking. Um, it skyrocketed. We're seeing it in all the states, and everyone's saying it, too. Silicon Valley's online slave market. Remember I said that was a really good place for it? I know, I told you. This is a good place to go um, if you want to report about missing and exploited children. It actually is a good place to go. So I just kind of want to show you some things that the Paladin Project, it has just opened, okay? But, um, That's really interesting. So anyways, um, yeah, I just kind of wanted to wrap this for a second and just show you what it's about. If you want to check it out, um, the mission is to combat crimes against women and children. I've only just started volunteering for them. There'll be more work to come, but, um, you know, as more jobs are needed for me to do, and I, I have been sick for a couple days and I had to do things for my business today, but we'll be doing more on this soon but i just kind of wanted to show you some of the things that it's representing and um, i'm really excited about it and that it exists